Hi, this is Shlomi. Wanted to share some thoughts on the future of work. So recently I've been rereading the Communist Manifesto. Maybe there's something in the air, and, and there's this one point that Marx and Engels make that has always stood out to me. The tendency of the capitalist system is to drive the majority of the middle class into the working ranks and a very small minority into the upper class. And if you look at the numbers over the last few decades, you see that to a great extent, Marx was right. I've also been thinking about why Marxism never really caught on in the United States. And as much as Marx was right about this particular aspect of capitalism, he missed a purely American invention, and that's racism. Now, other empires also had slavery or discriminatory practices or oppression. And while that's true, America did invent a socioeconomic system based at its very foundation, not on class struggle or religious beliefs, but on a putatively physiological feature. It forcibly imported slaves and it built the economic and social legacy of this country on that oppression. If Marx did accurately describe the American socioeconomic systems, then companies would be over-investing in workforce training. That's because once the economy shifted from a goods economy to a service and knowledge economy, the means of production also shifted towards a production of intellectual capital. That's why workforce development is a revolutionary act, because it works against historical systems of oppression. Workforce development creates opportunity. It invests in underestimated communities. That to me is the future of work. A world in which every person is able to maximize their abilities in order to meet their needs.